Those of you who have gotten to know me over the years as a writer know that I enjoy writing poetry just as much as I enjoy writing music. And the song Twilight was started as a poem for me. As a matter of fact, on my iPhone here, I often in the notes app um, start poems and start ideas. And I see this one started quite a long time ago and it was called Evening Song. Now it is called Twilight because as the poem developed, I realized Twilight was really the special word. And um, it's basically three verses that I wrote as a poem all about that beautiful time of day, that most serene time when the sun is about to disappear and there's that beautiful glow of colors. And in, in the middle of the song, you hear me talk about the colors pink and red, purple and blue. They appear on the horizon and then they slowly fade from view as the sky turns to black in twilight. Um, musically, I set this as a very simple, almost folk song-like with triads. If you were to look at the SSA, you'll see that the triads move in parallel motion a lot, like a folk group would do. And then for SAB, what often works is we take that middle note of the triad and we move it down here an octave lower, and we have like six between uh, a lot of the voices. And again, they move kind of parallel along. Um, it's S-A-B, which means if you sing the big notes only, gentlemen, it's going to be a true baritone range. But you will notice that I put several cues in there. If you're working with a choir that doesn't have a full range of baritone notes, there are options. Enjoy Twilight. 